Ström från Tate Och Sole Och Sole Mio Ström från Tate Ström från Tate Okej, så This is much more fun when you do it alone. Right now, I'm choking up as well. I'm not saying any better when I'm alone. Right now, I definitely feel, you know, super conscious because of the camera. So, but you got the idea. You listen to a song you like, and then you make an attempt to sing it yourself. And go back and forth. Read the lyrics, listen to the song. Easy, simple, fun, why the heck not? Try it. The reason we feel so insecure about singing is because we compare ourselves to the singers who we listen to. The professional rock musicians, rock stars, musicians. So when you compare yourself to them and you're listening to yourself, of course, they self-judgment. You don't practice nearly as much as singing. So the comparison is unfair. So don't compare yourself to those who do it professionally. Just like you don't compare yourself to Formula One racers when you go out driving. You can just drive and get around and benefit from it. Same with singing. You can just sing and benefit from it. You don't need to be a pro at it. So I brought my phone. I wanted to just quickly type in positive effects of singing and what comes up. Singing improves your mood. That's a no-brainer. It is a very effective stress reliever and improves sleep. Singing releases pain relieving endorphins, helping you to forget that painful tooth, knee, whatever aches. So it does help you to relieve your pain. When you sing and you have an emotional pain, singing actually helps you chemically. Your posture improves, true. Lung capacity increases and singing clears sinuses and respiratory tubes. So there are plenty of positive effects of it. Try it. The same try. One of my dearest tribes who I had the chance to spend time together with, sometimes a month at a time. Now these people have an unbroken lineage of 200,000 years. So all their rituals, the way how they lead their daily lives, had been passed down from generation to generation for thousands, tens of thousands, even hundreds of thousands of years. That's very unique. Singing is something that is part of their traditional lives. Each of these families, when there's a baby born into the family, they eventually teach the baby, the kid, their way of singing the song. And each family does that. And when the tribe sits together and everyone sings their own way the song, there's another song that emerges, the tribe's song. Which is a nice metaphor for having individuality, but also belonging to something bigger, a tribe society. But singing is something that is part of their traditional lives. Oh, just yes. be, before yeah. we end. Americans sing when they talk. Oh, okay. Because here I feel that it's it's more focused on melody. Mm -hmm. Like you say, like, do you like burger? Do you like burger? It, it changes a lot. Yeah. Okay, so if you're an American, Hey, you ought to sing because your language itself is sells itself as a singing language and I remember before speaking English that English did sound really melodic uh, for me as well so and I fell in love with English before I knew how to speak it so I guess uh, there's some other folks who feel the same it's true right <laughs> well, thanks again Rafa. I appreciate it thank you thank you all right